thinking, it's not just me, it's not just Devin, it's just, it's not just us. Oh, my foot. My foot is so swollen. My ankle is swollen. People have been, we've been traveling since 4 o'clock. I mean, I didn't sleep, of course, I don't take my medicine when I have to travel, so I have to be cognizant. But it's just like people have been waiting for flights and trying to get everywhere, trying to get go on their flight, just like we did. And it just kept getting, you know, the first flight was supposed to be from six o'clock, uh, five o'clock in the morning to about 6.30, we would get to Dallas. And then everything changed. And they made us load, they loaded us onto the plane. And then after about 15 minutes waiting for everybody else to put their bags up on the thing overhead, they told us we had to get off the plane. I thought it was a joke. Then, so we had deplaned once. Then we, we waited and, you know, Devin got a wheelchair and I was walking, so... You and Thomas could be proud of me. Um, there was no wheelchair for me, so I just was, you know, pulling my my bags. See, right here, right there. And then Devin was able to put our bags overhead. We get back on the plane, do the same thing, put the bags on overhead. And about 15 minutes or 10 minutes after that, we had our seatbelts on, getting ready to go. They actually did go for like five minutes, and then they said, oh, sorry, bad news, we got to get off the plane again. We, we thought it was a joke, again. So that was the second time. So we just go back into the airport. Then they did it a third time, and Devin goes, I'm not getting off the plane. But they were like, hey, we're going to let you stay on the plane this time and not take your bags down. So then we finally get here and then they were like, sorry, you missed your flight, your second flight to Newark. So we, we I wait on a long, 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 long line. And then they tell me, oh, you gotta go to the customer service desk. So then we, we go back to this other place. I wait on that line. And Devin actually got up and was, you know, trying to talk to the guy. And he was like, there's no Newark flights at all. They're gone. They're totally gone. <laughs> we were like, what do you mean they're gone? Well, there's none today. There's none tomorrow. Maybe Friday, but you'd be on a waiting list. So, like, what, we're going to sleep over in the airport for two days? I don't think so. Uh, so then they tell us, okay, the Philly flight. You could go on the... You can go from here, Pittsburgh, no, Pittsburgh sorry, Pittsburgh to, yeah, from Dallas to Pittsburgh, that's what I, I mixed up, I mixed that up, so nobody could pick us up there, so then we were supposed to go to LaGuardia after that, wait, your, fo your foot is there, okay. It's only like the afternoon, and I gotta go plug my phone in. Uh, now the next, so then I was waiting on the line because me and Devin weren't sitting together. We weren't even like in the same row. So then all of a sudden they, they kept changing the gate. Oh. And, what? Changed the time. At the, at and the, the, hour, and the time hour. and the gate. And the gate. And the Most time and the one. gate, yeah. And so then each time we would go on a cart like that, or we would try to walk it. And um, so then we finally get back and we're trying to figure it out. And I go, I'm waiting online just to get our seats together. And the lady goes, finally after like a half hour, some other lady comes out and she goes, can't put you on 
the Pittsburgh flight. I go, why not? We're on it already. And I really need to, and I, at that point I was, I was crying. Because I, I just couldn't, I can't, you know. I don't even have any energy to, anyway, I, do, I can't even put a sentence together. So she goes, because from the Dallas, um, you know, everything has gotten, and it's not just me. It's, some people are here since, this is nothing, some people are here since yesterday, some people are here two days, and they just, the, and then uh, this old lady that we came on the plane with, her and her mother, or her and her sister, they went to, they had to go to a hotel. Let's say a couple of other days. They're already in the airport for two days. They, the flights keep getting um, and they were on canceled. standby, which means that they, they were even short of it. It's a crapshoot. Yeah, they were on standby. And we didn't want to do that because if you're on standby and and everything just gets canceled, you just lose the flight. That's why we took the Pittsburgh. So she goes, I can't put you in Pits Pittsburgh because now this flight from Dallas to Pittsburgh is already running an hour late and that flight isn't going to be there. So I'm going to send you to upstate New York. Uh, not upstate. Durham, Durham New York. Durham, yeah. New York. Durham Bowls from the, uh, the But movie. I couldn't think of where that was. And I just, I was like, are we going to get there on time? Like she can't, she's not a, a magician yeah, or God. But, but Durham has a thousand people in it. And yeah, it's it's not gonna be a big plane. Probably has propellers. Right. Uh, anyhow, she was like, "No, I can't. I can't give you a hundred percent answer. Um, you know, wh where is, the, where else do you want to go?" And at that point, we were already changed like four times, and now we're waiting, even waiting for this flight. Why did they give us Durham originally? It was so good. Yeah. It's just. Very sad about it. No, I was I was just doing a video about what's been going on.